came to Washington, I applied at several places, Bellevue, Redmond, Kirkland, Everett, and I got offers, but when I got called back for interviews and actually drove into Edmonds, uh, I was sold just by driving in. Coming down Fifth Avenue, seeing the water, the character of the town, people walking their dogs along sidewalks and things like that. When people are walking their dogs and enjoying the town out and about, they're comfortable, they're happy. There were so many good signs that this is a good community. Yeah, I liked Edmonds because Edmonds is one of the first cities that my family visited when we first moved up here. It's just beautiful, nice sunsets, which is one reason why I like working the graveyard shift. Coming as a lateral officer, there's often two concerns. Is this guy gonna be a know-it-all? Are we just getting someone else's problem? It's really a hurdle for a new lateral officer to overcome. I felt very welcomed here uh, when, when I arrived. And all the way from my training officer coming and meeting my kids and helping me move in, all the way to the chief, ensuring that I knew that he had an open door and I could come and talk to him at any point. One of the best things I like about this department is the open door policy that the chiefs have here. And, you know, throughout the day, you can walk by the chief's office. If you feel like walking in and talking to them about a police-related matter, they welcome you to come in. And if it's not police-related matter, they don't mind if you come in just to say hi and talk story with them. I think the greatest impact I had in the community was working on the Joint Terrorism Task Force. So I had a background in intelligence and I didn't know for sure how that would apply in Edmonds. It's a town of 40,000 people or so, a waterfront community, nice place to live. But it turns out it's also 15 minutes from Seattle and has every walk of life here like it does anywhere else. There was one instance where there was a gentleman who was also the caretaker for his mom. His mom actually was calling us to check on his welfare because he was always intoxicated. Here's his mom who's sick and the son's supposed to be taking care of her, but she's having to take care of him. So we've been there numerous times and oddly enough, what it took was his getting arrested for an assault to straighten him up. And after he got arrested, he actually wrote wrote to me and called and thanked me for arresting him. He sobered up from there and it made him realize you know, the impact that his drinking was having upon his mom and uh, his, himself. I think that lateral candidates who want to come to Edmonds, the skills that they learned along the way will do nothing but benefit them, no matter what their tasks were before. Whether it's a small department of five people um, or one of the largest agencies in the state. People that work and do good work and understand the nature of this job as a profession, they're going to do well here. There's good support from the administration. You get heard. There's good support from the community. There's no us versus them hatred. It doesn't exist here. And I love that fact. First thing would be to do a few ride-alongs, not just one, at least minimum of two, preferably three. If they really like it here, I would suggest that they get their application in as soon as possible because positions in law enforcement don't open up very often. They need to get their foot in the door right away. 